Hello, I'm Andy and I'm going to read to you a weekly horoscope from the 12th of August to the 18th of August and this is for you coming from Pisces. So let's start with the 12th of August and it doesn't start very well for you and it's not going to end very well for you in the evening nightfall period. So it's 24 hours of problems. It's all up to you. In the morning and afternoon periods, don't be stubborn, don't be dominating and don't go against authority and so treat your bosses with respect, treat your manager with respect at your place of work, work well with your colleagues as well. And if you are not, then you're going to lose, to lose a lot of ground with them. And if you are in business, don't want to plan too big. Don't try to give out plans that are not really workable. So the danger is that you may outreach what you can attempt to do. Well, it's a Sunday and it's going to be a holiday. So tell yourself that whatever you try and do may not go down well with others. And if you are out with your business people playing golf or out with your colleagues, don't be bossy, don't be pushy, don't be dominating. The evening nightfall periods, many, many planets that make you very rebellious are seen. So these rebellious planets tend to make you disagree with people. So you will be against the plans of what have, people have. You will be making decisions which others don't like. because. These planets throughout the day are very negative. So their duty is to make you look negative and behave negative. So why don't you throughout the whole day, let somebody else in your family or friends or whoever, let them tackle how to plan the day, whether in the evening or the nightfall period or even the day period. And that way you won't be able to be blamed for doing something wrong because that's what these planets want to do. You will insist on planning and then the planners will make sure this all goes wrong. So let others do the planning and you'll have a much better day. The 13th of August seems to get even worse for you. So the morning and afternoon, unexpectedly all plans and all things you decided to do will go wrong. It's a Monday. So at your place of work or in business, there's a lot to gain. I'm sorry, there's a lot to lose. And so a lot to lose means your job can be insecure because suddenly news will come which is very bad. And that may come because teamwork will be very poor and situations will become bad. And so there will be many complaints against you very easily at your place of work. You got to be a person to adapt to things. And I would rather you be part of a team in the morning afternoon period than trying to go alone because one of these planners like you to go alone so that you can do things your way. Don't, because things are going to go very bad. Evening nightfall period, again things become worse. So the morning negative planets who created so much trouble in the morning afternoon make their way to the evening as well to join other planets. And so there is chaos in the evening nightfall period. Either the chaos is created by you because everything you did goes wrong, all the planning is bad, timetables have changed and all sorts of difficulties are seen or some kind of arguments are going to spoil the evening nightfall period. Some of these planets who create arguments are also there in the morning afternoon. So throughout the whole day, no argument and tell yourself you don't want to take the lead because when you expose into the lead, everything wrong will happen. So lie low, be part of a team, let other people throughout the whole 24 hours of this 13th of August, let other people take control and plan, just sit back and enjoy yourself. 14th of August starts in a very difficult way for you at your place of work or in business. Miscalculation, misinformation, money can be lost very fast in business because of a bad decision. At your place of work you can get difficulties with your superiors very very quickly. Make sure you don't argument, don't get into any argument. Make sure you, that you don't try to put blame or criticize people. You need support during this morning afternoon period of the 14th of August. You need support desperately. You want friends, you don't want to make enemies. So the morning and afternoon says that whatever you attempt to do must have a difficulty to it. So don't be hasty, don't be impatient. Think before you say, think before you do. This way, when you slow down, you will be able to not get into the position of making mistakes too quickly. Evening nightfall improves a lot. 
improves a lot. So you can see how a day can change. Evening nightfall, you just get plain lucky. And you probably will find solutions which you earlier couldn't find in the part of the day. And you can make friends in the evening nightfall. You can somehow be forgiven for whatever went wrong was happened. And if you are planning to do any kind of night lifing, going out for a for a, for a night life and having enjoyed time, it's a good time. And mix business and pleasure, because some of the morning planets are very business minded and they wish to join you in the evening. So mix business and pleasure. You can help get help for your increasing ability of getting a better job or perhaps better in business as well. So the evening ends up very nicely on the Tuesday, 14th of August. Now we come to the 15th of August and now you're going to have 24 hours of very good luck. So everything starts in the morning, afternoon at your place of work in business. Even before you leave home, everything is going perfectly nicely. And the drive to work, the drive to your place of business is also good. And when you get there, you'll have very good news. You'll be very creative. And in the place of work, you'll find that your bosses like you very much and they prefer to give you some kind of good news. And if you're in business, you will see that your business uh, approach will be wonderful. The creativity will be flowing. Communication assets will be wonderful. So you've got to make use of every hour, speak to people, communicate, ask favours. You'll get a lot done in the morning afternoon period. Evening nightfall seems to be even better. And evening nightfall, well, if you're going to be on the internet, because I see many global planets here, you're going to score something very lucky on the internet in the evening and nightfall period of the 15th of August. And so whether it's hunting for a job anywhere in the world, wanting to do business with people in the world, whether looking for the friendship or looking for the romance, anything from the world, you will score very high points in the evening nightfall period and get very lucky in whatever you want to do. If you're not interneting, then going out with your friends or whoever you're going out with will also pay a lot of good dividends. So evening nightfall, perfect to get the good bonding in anything you want to do. 16th of August starts brilliantly for you in the morning, afternoon. Planets are moving very nicely for you. Your communication assets, your marketing sense. And you'll have a sixth sense about things too. You will feel to say the right thing and do the right thing. And at your place of, at your place of work, you'll get plenty good response from your superiors or your bosses. And if you're in business, you will score some very good points. You'll have this magic touch of somehow attracting people, talking to them, getting some good business contacts or even making some good business contracts possible. So you've got to try your best. Every hour counts. You don't get such wonderful morning and afternoon periods. And if you're going to be on the internet, you'll make some great, either find great solutions or either find some great contacts. And that's going to be another very high point in your morning and afternoon period. I don't like your evening nightfall period and if you don't have to be out, go back to the safety of your home because the planets are moving very slowly and firstly everything you plan or somebody else plan can be postponed or cancelled. People won't show up, your date may not show up, you get pretty unhappy and depressed. So double check everything that you wanted to plan to do because plans are going to be changed. And even if you go out, you intend to go out, something gloomy is going to be seen. You are not going to be able to find your way to get anything that you want to. But if you already have planned to go out, then tell yourself, do not be too expectant of what you want. That way you'll be very relaxed and you'll just enjoy yourself and make some context. But I can find that in the evening nightfall, disappointments will be quite a lot, so watch out for that. The 17th of August, which is a Friday, morning, afternoon, everything goes very slow. And so there are delays. And if you have urgent deadlines to meet, you will be in trouble. So something's going very wrong in the morning, afternoon. And the reason is that your planets have slowed down. So whatever you are waiting for a result doesn't come. Delays are the result. And so trying to do too much will be a problem. Try to do something which is very important and that alone is enough because there's too much of slowness for you to meet deadlines. So at least meet the deadline of something most important. Bad news can come from the past and it can affect you whether in your place of work or in business. 
and that can also be a downer in the sense that it produces bad vibes and therefore you lose chances of getting things what you want done in the morning afternoon very frustrating period you just have to be patient the more impatient you are the worse is what it will happen because you can't be faster than your own planets then we go to the evening nightfall period and now very aggressive planets are there well they are not totally against you they to but they make you react very aggressively in speech or action so don't want to do that take the soft approach whenever you have aggressive planets and you feel aggressive tell yourself mentally i have to take the soft approach which means use words which are soft tone of voice which is soft a body language which is soft and you'll get your things done in a very nice way so evening nightfall be careful everything to you try to do will be a struggle and um, if you don't have to go out don't because you can easily be irritated and annoyed as well 18th of august it's a saturday and you'll somehow wake up angry angry about something or another something what is being said and so that's going to start the way of the morning and afternoon try not to do that immediately remind yourself what you heard me say take the soft approach use words which are soft and that way you will find calmness will return in the morning afternoon period if it's a working day tell yourself that you cannot be too pushy or blunt with people or insulting to people you'll not get anything done at place of work and if you're not working and it's a holiday you don't want to spoil the mood of the people you're in so be the friendly person be negotiable and at the same time try to go with a soft language and the soft actions and you'll manage to do well enough evening nightfall i like much better for you there are planets that want you to meet somebody very important or at least to meet somebody who can help you so you don't want to be arrogant you don't want to be the person to be in the limelight and be important no be humble work with people as much as you can and you will see that the evening nightfall you might meet somebody very important for you in some area of your life and if you act humbly and you have act, uh, act as a person very negotiable and very approachable that would be really good so you'll make some very valuable contacts in the evening nightfall period and uh, these are going to help you in the long term well that's the week for you i'm already skyping and i'm charging usd 550 for a 90 minute skype session and during this 90 minutes i'll talk to you about your next 7 or 8 years in all areas of your life and that will be based on your date of birth and time of birth and at the same time i will give you much information and i of course talk about your palms as well and i'll talk to you about your personal lucky lottery numbers based on your date of birth time of birth and looking at your palms and you can compare your personal lottery numbers with what i'm giving every month to people in pisces and if the numbers are very close to each other what i've given you personally and what i'm giving generally then you'll have to be very busy that month to go buying lottos so that will be an added plus for you and i'll give you your lucky colors and your lucky directions and your lucky days and a lot more other information so go to skype go to facebook send me an email let's make the the date so that i can get your next 7 or 8 years as much as under your control as possible until then thank you and good luck